Well, it's Wednesday, and that means the work week is halfway out the door. It's it's, it's on its way out. I know it doesn't seem like it, because it's right at the midway point. But today, boy, have we got something good today to talk about. It's It might as well be Kung Fu Wednesday. We're discussing Shadow from 2018, and you don't want to miss this. So don't go anywhere. We'll be right back. Previously on the Nerdy Ronin Network. Hey, Squeaky. What were you asking me about uh, Bruno Mars music? A song you liked and you had a question? Yeah. No. no. Versace? The song Bruno Mars is singing is not about ramen or wine. It's Versace on the floor. That's a designer label. Oh my goodness. Happy, happy hump day. Every single body. How are you doing? I hope your week is going well. If not, turn it around. Have a cup of coffee. Have an extra one. Have a shot of espresso. On me. Go ahead. And be kind to each and everybody. How about that? (laughs) Like and subscribe if you haven't already. We appreciate you being here. Coming here three days a week. Sometimes more. But always three days a week. Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. Our links are down below. If they're not, thenerdyronin.com. Man, have I got something awesome to talk about today. That's right. Fantastic. I kind of enjoyed it. I'm not sure, but I'm pretty certain. I liked everything about it. Let's look at it, shall we? Shadow. Original title was Ying. 2018. Not rated. Hour and 56 minutes. In a Chinese royal court, an army commander secretly trains a shadow to retake a city against the wishes of the king. Directed by Yi Mu Zhang, writers Wei Li, Yi Mu Zhang, Su Jin Ju, I don't know, uh, Chao Ding, Li Sun, Ryan Cheng are starring in it. I'm sure those are all correct the way I said them. If not, that's okay too. Alright, look, this movie is shot beautifully, first things first. It's like. It's in color, but everything is like black and gray and it, it, the color schemes, there's white as well. Like, it's just interesting, okay? I'd never heard of this before and I stumbled upon it and I was going to watch it for my very own entertainment. And it turned out to be so interesting. Here we are. <laughs> So it is rather long, almost two hours, and there's a couple of spots where I, I, it was a little confusing. I'm not going to lie. There was a little bit, like, at the, when it started off, I wasn't sure what was going on, and I was kind of like, eh, meh, but then it changed, and it changed for the better. It's so beautiful. It's well shot. The actors are great. The story is fantastic. And there are twists and, like, you don't know who's working for who. The fight scenes are really well done. I enjoyed it. I enjoyed it a lot. And once it was over, I just sat there thinking, that was beautiful and fun and complex. And the way it ended, I'm not sure if I liked it. (laughs) (laughs) <laughs> the ending, I mean, the ending, okay? The ending. Like, I just, I loved the world that they built. The world they built, the characters they made, and, and they filled out through storytelling and world building, it all came together in the end. In a quite surprising way. Do watch it. And when it's over, did you see that coming? Did you see that coming? Like, you, there's surprises. Through. It's like a two-hour-long Christmas 
with surprise presents. <laughs> you think Christmas is over and then pow, new present. <laughs> or it's like a surprise birthday party. Every little bit, there's a pow, new gift. <laughs> Fantastic. And it's artistry. Like, there's nothing, like, the fighting doesn't raise the bar where you're like, oh, wow, I've never seen that before. No. However, the artistic vision of the director is fantastic. The scenery, the cinematography, everything works. And it's a visual treat for your eye holes. All right. We say all the time we're looking for good entertainment. This starts off slow, but man, is it great entertainment. And the ending leaves you kind of wondering because you're left with a certain character deciding what they're going to do. And it doesn't tell you what they decide, but it's the most important decision of their life. Truly. It'll get you. It will get you. And it's fantastic. If you've never seen this, you should watch this. It was great. Um, I believe it was on Tubi and Freebie. One of those. I don't remember which. Uh, I, even though I just watched it. Oh, man. Pretty sure it was Tubi. It was Tubi. Yeah. And then I... <laughs> sorry. I'm a brain broke there for a second. Uh, because the movie I'm watching for Friday, I had to hunt around for because it's on Tubi, but there's no, uh, there's no subtitles. <laughs> so for this Kung Fu Friday, I had to find it somewhere else. And it happens to be Freebie. And I don't enjoy watching things on Freebie because their ads are pretty constant. Unlike Tubi, where, you know, they don't bombard you. But, for me to bring you the goodness that's coming on Friday, for Kung Fu Friday, I gotta tell you, I'm gonna have to use Freebie. But it is what it is. Looks like a fantastic movie. Besides that, I want you to know, you need to watch this movie. It, it's, it's theoretically a Kung Fu movie. But, there's more to this it's it's got layers like an onion so check it out i want to hear what you think in the comments down below so please let me know because when it was first over with i was like ah and then after a few minutes i was like oh <laughs> i even rewound it back to the beginning i know rewound it right Started it over so I could make sure I had it right from the beginning. You'll know what I'm talking about if you watch it. So, there you go. Great movie. I enjoyed it. It's well worth a watch. Might even watch it twice. Uh, make sure I didn't miss anything. It, it, it's it's fantastic. So, there you go. That, that hum day's over. <laughs> Once again, we appreciate each and every one of you that shows up every every show and every week. Thank you. We got to get out of here. Be kind to one another. Have a cup of coffee. Energy drink. Water. Whatever you like. And just take a minute and relax. And get some good entertainment in your soul. <laughs> For Michael the Microphone, Bob, squeaky chair in the back, and this... Silly fat nerd. We'll see you on Friday. <laughs>